Tiffany and I am here with the Zuru Robo Alive Lurking Lizard and Slithering Snake. I want to thank Zuru for sending these to me to open up with you guys today. So the Lurking Lizard tilts his head, stops, and looks for prey. Ooh. And the snake, my tongue flicks out, my eyes move. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Each of these, okay, no. The lizard requires two AA batteries, which are not included. The snake needs two AAA batteries, which are also not included. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Let's see, is there anything on the kind of like the back? Oh, there is, okay. I have move my, I move at rapid speed. My eyes reflect light. I pause when you tilt my head. My rubber tail feels like, feels lifelike. Oh my gosh. Add some adventure with your very own lifelike robotic lizard. Enhanced technology means he scurries at rapid pace, outrunning even the fastest pre of predators. Can you catch him? And then there's also other lizards. There's an well, there's another lizard. There's a Saharan red lizard, and then we have the Indo-Chinese lizard. Now there's two different snakes available as well. So the one we have here, and then the um, well, the one we have is the Scarlet King Snake, and the one we need is the Green Emerald Tree Boa. I'm so excited. I really like this idea, and I like how they actually have breeds for the animals, so that you know. Anyway, the snake slithers like a real snake. His tongue flicks continuously, and his eyes hunt for prey. Are you a game to tame a snake? Live life on the wild side with your very own life, real-life robotic snake. Watch as it silently slithers along the ground, flicking its tongue on the hunt for its next meal. So let's go ahead and get these out of the packages so we can start playing with them. In each pack you get an instruction booklet, so let's just take a look at the snake one first. The snake one I actually was looking at for a long time, I was like, how do I install the batteries? And I was like, oh, maybe I should look at the instructions. So you actually have to take the head off of the snake to install the batteries, so it shows you right here how to change those. So always read the instructions, and then there's playing instructions and all that fancy stuff. Then we have the lizard one. That one was also a little tricky to figure out how the batteries went and you have to turn it over and then install them in the top. It's weird, but I figured it out. We have our little friends here. So this is the lizard. <laughs> he looks super cool. I really am loving these. I love their eyes. He does have a very rubbery tail, but then it stops right about here, and then this is just a hard plastic body. Well, I guess his, his front legs are kind of like rubbery a little bit, but everything else is pretty much, you know, hard plastic. And then we have our snaky snake, which reminds me of those snakes. I don't know what they're called. I don't even know if they have a technical name, but they're the snakes that you hold the head of, and like, you know, they're jointed like this, so they, they can move and look like, you know, those little cheap 99 cent toys. I don't know if you guys are, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, it's <laughs> very flexible here. And this is the button where you would take the head off. His tongue is actually really cute and it's just like a little rubbery. And his eyes, oh, his eyes are beautiful. So on each one of these, they have an on off switch. This one is off, the on off switch is there obviously. And then this one, this one's also off and the on off switch is right there. So let's take a look at the snakey snake first. Oh, okay, there's his eyes moving. Oh, look at his tongue. Oh, don't go on the table. Oh, this is pretty neat, you guys. Oh my gosh, this is neat. This is the way this moves. Oh my gosh, this is super cool. Okay, so let me just, the only downside is it is a little bit noisy, but that's not bad. I really like it. Now we have the lizard. Oh, wow, he looks like he moved really fast. So let's see. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, he really goes. And it's like when you set him down. So if you have him up, he won't go. Well, it doesn't, it seems like he won't go. Oh, maybe when his head's down, that's the trigger there. So if his head's up, he won't go. Oh my gosh, he's so savage. Look at him. He's absolutely, let's shut him off. He needs a break. He's, this guy is insane. I want to look at his eyes though. I didn't look at his eyes. Do they move at all? I don't think they move. No. 
Well, that was fun. Oh my goodness, these guys are insane. Let me know in the comments below which one was your favorite. I think I'm going to choose, oh my gosh, it's so difficult because they were so different. I loved how he was absolutely crazy, but this one looked more, I guess, realistic and cool in that way. Anyway, let me know your favorite in the comments down below. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe because I post new videos every single day. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!